Praise to Lord, dear brothers and sisters. A novena to Saint Benedict, day three. Saint Benedict is a patron saint of the wide variety of people and needs, including against poisons, agriculture workers, civil engineers, dying, those afflicted with fever, those with gallstones, those with inflammatory diseases, those with kidney diseases, members of religious orders, monks, school children, and spelunkers, cave explorers. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. In the Holy Rule, Saint Benedict, you have said. Brothers, the Holy Scripture cries to us, saying, Everyone that exalts himself shall be humbled, and he that humbles himself I shall be exalted. Luke chapter 14 verses 11 18 verses 14 Since therefore he says this, he shows us that every exaltation is a kind of pride. Hence, better if we wish to reach the greatest height of humility and faciality, speedily to arrive at the heavenly exaltations to which ascent is made in the present life by humility. Then, mounting by our actions, we must erect the ladder which appears to Jacob in his dream, by means of which angels were shown to him ascending and descending. Genesis chapter 28 verses 12 Without a doubt, we understand this ascending and descending to be nothing else but that we descend by pride and ascend by humility. The erected ladder, however, is our life in the present world, which if the heart is humble and is by the Lord lifted up to heaven. For we say that our body and our soul are the two sides of this ladder, and into this size the divine calling has inserted various degrees of humility or discipline which we must mount. Glorious and Benedict, sublime, Model of virtue, pure vessel of God's grace, behold me humble, kneeling at your feet. I implore you in your loving kindness to pray for me before the throne of God. To you I have recourse in the dangers that daily surround me. Shield me against my selfishness and indifference to God and to my neighbor. Inspire me to imitate you in all things. May your blessing be with me always, so that I may see and serve Christ in others and work for his kingdom. Graciously obtain for me from God who those favors and graces which I need so much in the trials, miseries and afflictions of life. Your heart was always full of love, compassion and mercy toward those who were afflicted or troubled in any way. You never dismissed without consolation and assistance anyone who had recourse to you. I therefore invoke your powerful intercessions, confident in the hope that you will hear my prayers and obtain for me the special grace and favor I earnestly implore. Mention your invitations. Help me, grace and benedict, to live and die as a faithful child of God, to run in the sweetness of His loving will, and to attain the eternal happiness of heaven. Saint Benedict, pray for us. Amen.